the vibes name was from grade nine and it just come up with me. You know, right throughout. And then when I got the zip, them just oh yeah, yeah, yeah. vibes in him. And them just keep it. Um the page now is a different thing because it was originally my personal page. But it does create a page because everybody did have Instagram. I mean I said, oh more Instagram too. You know, and me always I always drop jokes like in person and them thing there. So when we get Instagram, one of my coworker um, commented on my first post and said, Jesus, peace, Instagram mash up now. This is one of the Instagram. So, at the same personality, they now come through with the memes and the this and the that and the captions and all of these. Things. Well, the captions is because I was a brilliant literature student, you know what I'm saying? My literature teacher would be very proud. Well read, you know what I mean? I read all kind of different books. Science, maths, you name it, fiction, non-fiction, Shakespeare. So my time I just sit up. Well, most of the time, I was an only child, so you know, reading was was the only thing. You know, I never had nobody for run up and down with anything there. So yeah, for hours and hours, I just sit up and read books and all them thing there. And yeah, that's all. I can write them captions and them thing there. Um. Yeah, so it was a personal page at the time. And then me just see like it start get super popular. People start asking me, yo, you wanna do some promo for me like post my thing for your page and me say, mm, nah. You know, can't me did I use it for like post my little girlfriend at the time and you know what I mean my personal achievements and them little thing. So one day I said to myself, yo, the page I get too popular, you know. Like it was at forty thousand people at that time. I say, all right, I'm gonna switch it. So I'm gonna create a personal page and I'm gonna flip it. And from that, it does take off. Like, you know, that's how that page came about. You know, so the memes and the this and the network start get big. You know, some government minister follow me and all of them things. I say, what? You know, some people from the embassy, some top people in a society. I mean, I say, yeah. Alright then. And then you know the whole following grew and all them things. So yeah, that's how that page come about. And you know my ask for Sharon. <laughs> Sharon no. Let me tell you how that Sharon something come about. Um I was writing one of those famous captions I did the right I'm a gate. And this lady when named Sharon from up the road was passing and me don't know who it was, but somebody did a call her name and then did a call her name so ghetto. You know what I mean? Like they would say, yo, Sharon, right? And they say, wow, why would you mash up the woman's name so? You know what I'm saying? So I was in the middle of writing a caption about something. And I say, hmm, I'm gonna just drop in the name. And then all of a sudden people start take to it. And I say, okay, I'm gonna just continue. The Sharon personality now is based on experiences I've had with women. Um, my ex-girlfriend, who was my girlfriend at the time, you know, we used to take little scenarios and kind of, you know, stretch it a little bit because she never did so awful still. You know what I'm saying? So, hmm. And then, because I used to post her, people used to say, oh, Sharon this. So, it does automatically fit that whoever I'm dating at the time just assume that personality that role you know so that's Sharon so it was an accident made the whole character created <laughs> but you know it works most times 